what's going on people we back again and I'm gonna do a, a little different video today I've had a lot of people a lot of new people subscribe to my channel and a lot of them might have not seen some of my earlier videos and I'm gonna make it easier for, for you instead of making you go back and watch all the videos and see what I did to the Mustang I'm just gonna go over every mod on this video right here today um, and this is for my new subscribers. I want this is something to show that I appreciate you guys. I'm gonna save some leg work. Um, and these are the mods I've done to the Mustang so far. Um, as you can see, I have the AM. It's a brute force cold at intake. Um, this right here works very well with keeping the engine cool, keeping the, the inland air temperature very, very low, and not letting it, the heat from the engine interfere with the, with the cold air going into the engine. Um, and I also added the 73 millimeter throttle body. That with this and the tune increased throttle response and it, it, a whole lot. It feels like a, a whole different car. Um, and as you can see, all the blue and red wires. That's a Taylor wire loom kit. I, I also added. I've added the uh, JLT satin oil separator um, with the. Uh, Boss 302 uh, strut tower brace and I've tinted the headlights really can't it, it's dark in the light but the, the sun is shining right on but I tinted the, all the lights I gotta tint the marker lights next um, I've added the uh, American Muscle uh, bullet wheels and the extreme stock drill and slotted rotors with ceramic pads. I got Nankang, I guess it's Noble Sport 20, size 245, 40, 20. That gives it a perfect, a perfect ride height. Not too tall, not too small. Makes the ride a little bit more enjoyable. Y'all gotta excuse the rim of the car dirty. I'm about to watch it right now. But that this size tire to me is the perfect size for a 20 on this S197. The 35 series, 255, 35 is a little bit small. It's wider, but it's a little bit too small for my taste. So I went with this size. It's a perfect size on the eight inch, on the eight and a half inch rim to me. Um, it looks awesome to me too. Um, I've also added the GT350 style louvers. A lot of people go with the ones that have like the vents. It looks all right to some people. To me, I didn't like it. I just like for it to look like it's like one piece. So it looks, it actually looks like it pops open. A lot of people ask me, did that open up? I said, no, it don't open, but it looks like it. So I like the more of the flush look. Um, then we've added the MMD ducktail spoiler. That right there, this single piece to me really makes the car it really brings the car out. When I had this, this spoiler on, because my car came without the spoiler, it really just made it look like an official Mustang. Um, also, we added the MMD, the trunk deck lid. The one I had before started to fade, and I didn't like the way it looked, so I added this one. This was easy to maintain. As you see, I can tell, I tell them the tail lights also. And those things you hear making all that noise is the, the Ross axle backs I've added. They sound good. It's one more thing. There's a couple of things I've added to um, 331 gears. And you really can't tell it. But I added a uh, GMS. It's an intake spacer up under here. It's it's good. It gives you a little bit more throttle response, but it's a bitch to put on because you have to use the same bolts, and the bolts ain't that long. So you have to you have to like put it. You have to tighten it up in a certain pattern to get it to go down. But you know, it gives you a, gives you a little bit of response, I think. And um, I've also got an SCT tuner on the car. I just used one of the can tools, one of the preloaded tools from the SCT. I'm gonna go for, go MPT later on, but 
with the tune that came from SCT, hey, it, it, that was that wasted the car up, and that's all I really needed. I have the BBK shorty headers too, but I haven't had them installed. And the next piece I'm gonna order will be the one piece dry shell. Like I said, I thanks for everybody that watched this video, everybody that subscribed. Y'all please stay tuned and, and stay tuned for a lot more mods. Thank you for the love, thank you for the support.